Yo, what is up, everybody? It's your boy, Sneaker Steve, back. <coughs> Sorry about that. It's your boy, Sneaker Steve, back, and I'm doing my collection video. I have to do them in parts because there's too many sneakers, and I don't want to bore you guys, and I don't want to make it a 30-minute video. Probably half of you guys won't even watch it after the first 10 minutes. So that's why I'm going to do them in parts. First up, we have... The DMP ones, Metro High, from a couple years back. This was to commemorate when MJ and the Bulls played Larry Bird and the Boston Celtics in the playoffs. And I believe it was MJ's first playoff game and he dropped 63 points on Boston. He came out with these. The DMP ones, he had the Boston colorway and he had the Chicago Bulls colorway. I love these joints right here, super badass. And then on the inside has the date, 63 points on both of them. So you can never forget. I think Larry Bird mentioned that, that uh, MJ was God in a basketball uniform or something like that. I thought that was, that was pretty funny. So that's the DMP ones. Up next we have the Toro 5, Toro Bravo 5 pack. It's pretty cool packaging. See the football right here behind. I think it was nice. Get the 3M 5 and the Toro 5s. Suede on these joints are amazing. These are supposed to be retroing again. I don't know when. I thought they said it was going to be this year. But maybe next year, but who knows? I don't care. I got mine on the pack. And this is the 3M. These are pretty cool because it looks black, and then when the light hits it, it changed completely uh, to a different color. So that is the Toro Bravo 5 pack. We have the Infrared 6 pack. Pretty cool pack came with the white infrared and the black infrared. This is not, this didn't come with 3M like the black infrareds did from last year. And I kind of like them like this better without the 3M. And you got the white tumble leather and you have the black new book and these bad boys. You gotta love it. Check on the bottom, still kind of icy. Not bad for a couple years back. So I believe, I'm trying to think. Yeah, these are still desk on. I haven't worn these yet. I did wear these once. So I gotta get around and wearing these again. So that is the infrared six pack. Moving right along, we have, oh man, it's a lot of sneakers. And I'm not meaning to brag or anything like that. It's just a pain in the ass. We have the Golden Moments pack, I believe from two years ago, maybe. Yeah, had the six and the seven, fresh pack. Came with American flag dust bag, pretty dope. And it came with the six and the seven. For me, I thought the sixes were the best out of the shoe. Just that white with the hints of gold. With the gold laces, gonna go wrong with that. A lot of people like did like the seven. It's a clean colorway, I, ha I have to admit. It's, it's pretty dope. I mean, black with the hints of, of gold, still sweet. What a lot of people did was they switched out the laces for these because the dust bags came with um, gray uh, gold laces. So some people switched out and put gold laces. Uh, you can switch out the gold laces with these and these came with a pair of white laces. So either way, you can do whatever you want. They got the bottoms. These are still icy. Still haven't worn none of these yet. These are both dead stock. I gotta get around and wearing these joints. So that's the Golden Moments pack. 
And now we're going back to one of the older packs. Jordan Countdown Pack. The 11-12. This one, it was the year of 23. And they were doing two sneakers that would add up to 23. And by far, this was probably the best one, the 11 and 12. Because they took the Taxi 12s and the Bread 11s. This is my all-time favorite shoe. I love this freaking shoe. A gorgeous looking shoe. It's just beautiful. Look at that. I've worn these a couple times and they still look freaking dead stock. And the best part is, this is never going to yellow. That's why I love this shoe. Taxi 12s. Still look great. I love the S as well. But I've worn these a couple times. This was a great pack right here. This was kind of what started that Jordan 11 craze during the holidays because these did release, this pack released during uh, Christmas time. And that's when everything exploded. That is the 11-12 pack. And finally we have a pack that came out last year. The Gift of Flight pack. Was lucky enough to get these. And of course, as many other people like myself, there was only wrong reason why I wanted that shoe. And there it is. Because of this freaking shoe right here. This shoe is so freaking gorgeous. This shoe, uh, I don't know. Whoa, whoa, what can you say? They put this shoe with this shoe. They got the 29s right here. I mean, you really wanted just this shoe, but they forced you to get, you know, you had to buy this shoe. But, you know, it is what it is. It's whatever. But who cares, right? All that matters is this shoe right here. The Patone 11s. Heard these are good basketball shoes. I haven't worn them yet. I've worn these a couple times already. I might just wear these when just walking around or whatever. Nothing special. But they're, I heard that they're super comfortable, so we'll see. That is the Gift of Flight pack. Happy to have these in the collection. So that'll do it for this part of my sneaker collection. Part one. My Jordan Countdown packs. So don't forget, if you like the vid, hit that thumbs up I would really appreciate that and if it is your first time watching thanks for watching if you like what you saw subscribe so you can see part two it will get more and more better I hope did that make any kind of sense uh, whatever uh, episode two will come out next Saturday so stay tuned for that follow me on Instagram and Twitter at sneaker Steve 9 also hit that subscribe button so you know as soon as I drop part two you'll be notified right away all right sneaker Steve I'm out of here peace